A tornado touched down in Oregon this week and meteorologist Rachel Garceau told you about this earlier on Wednesday and today our Sophia Bliss talked to the woman whose home was hit by the tornado about this very scary experience. Sophia. Brenda, Tammy Wyrick walked me through the moments that this happened. She said if it wasn't for her husband being with her that day, her reaction may not have been fast enough. I was at the front door. I um, mean, it was Sunday, so, you know, football. So my husband's in the living room. And I, I was telling him that, you know, it's Haley in town. And um, so I opened up the door and my grandson's in my playroom, which is in kind of the back of the house. And um, I, you know, saw the cows running. I saw the tornado in the barn roof. <laughs> and I was like, what's that? And he's like, tornado. And my mind went, oh, yes, that's what it is. <laughs> and so I took off running for the baby. My husband took off running to our back door. And um, then you hear it. You know, just, I don't know. I mean, if, you hear, if you've heard it, you know, you know. Um, I could have never fathomed from television. It's a little bit different. <laughs> um, so um, I grabbed the baby and I got back to the middle of the house, the hallway. And um, when I was running to get him, I saw the hall closet and I went to open it and it wasn't open. It wouldn't open. So I put my foot up because I have the three-year-old in my hands. And I put my foot up on the wall and I just pulled and that door swung open and it hit the back of the wall and I just threw him in there and I kind of just jumped on him and I hear my husband the, one of the worst sounds you'll ever hear in your life is him just saying no 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 Tammy stayed in the hall closet with her grandson until the tornado passed she says it took her a while to be able to get up because she was so shaken you saw the pictures of the damage to her home and her mother-in-law's home both of them saw damage and will need repairs, but she's choosing to have a positive outlook. I told my husband buy a lotto ticket because a lot of people think this this could have been bad, and it could have. I, I we we're just choosing to look at it like, aren't we lucky? I asked Tammy what she wants people to learn from her experience. She says, have a disaster plan. She explained if she hadn't run by the hall closet, she doesn't know where she and her grandson would have ended up, and she doesn't know if they would have been safe. Brenda, that tornado ended up being a rated an EF zero with an estimated peak wind of 85 miles an hour. It's very uncommon for a tornado to touch down in that part of Oregon and lots of parts of the Northwest. The last time Grant County had a tornado was in 1890. It's hard to think that this can really just happen to any one of us. So it's better to stay prepared yeah. just like she meant. So glad she's okay. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Sophia.